Hello, my name is John. Welcome to Green Dars 356 Engineering Channel. Today we will be assembling a dual blaster for soda and abrasive. These are the parts for the generic soda sand blaster. It comes from China and comes under many different names. The important thing is to remember the bicarbonate soda tank is this one and the abrasive media is the other one, which I'll refer to as left and right. The tanks come already pre-assembled, so you have to spring into position the carrying movable handle. Put it just in approximately to start with and then you attach the chassis rails that go inside those and you then have to align the holes for the brackets they come with these bolts you put them in place they supply washes but they are very thin washers, so I've used some inch mudguard type washers to spread the load and make it more of an engineering job. So you eventually put all of those in place and then you carry on to the next stage. Right, now the frame, basic frame has been assembled. The nuts and bolts are only finger tight because you have to put the axle in place. And things need to align. So it's first the axle, then a spacer. If you don't put the spacers, the wheels will jam on the tyres. Then the wheels, one of the washers, and a simple split pin inserted and only slightly opened up. There's no reason to bend them over completely at this stage. Having got this in, into position, you can then tighten these to make a firm, rigid structure. Right, you use a posi drive, number two screwdriver, and a 10 millimeter open-ended spanner or a ring spanner. Turn over the cylinders to install the leg, the front leg, which is simply sprung into place over these spigots. Now the manufacturer originally supplies with split pins for this job, but they're not very engineeringly good, so we have replaced them with five millimeter appropriate length screws, washers and nuts. So you align the holes, slip them in, and tighten with a spanner and a screwdriver. Keep them orientated so they're the same on either side. The next step is to install the pressure regulator valve, which is done with these screws. The next stage is to connect up the hoses from the regulator valve. They tell you nothing about this in the instruction book, but one assumes because of the lengths that they have given you that they can only go into certain places. So it's a simple matter of pushing the tube into the blue socket and it's automatically held in place so it's fast. 
Similarly again, this one can only go to this valve. And these two, and again the great word assumption is that this one goes to this one. And the other one goes to the other side. Hopefully later we won't find that they need to be crossed over. So watch this space. It appears that this solar blaster media blaster has two separate solar nozzles. One from the top and a combined one from the rear. So we're assembling the top one which you have to install using PTFE plumber's sealing tape which comes with the kit. Be careful that you get it tight enough because you don't need air to be leaking. Because this fitting is a plumbing fitting you will need an imperial size spanner which appears to be 5 sixteenths of an inch. So you screw it in. It's a tapered thread. And at the final thing with your 5 sixteenths spanner Tighten it. Good, and that's it. Final stage, assembling the blast nozzle to the tanks. You will notice that the nozzles have a green and a red on and off valve. The same colour as the soda tank is green and the red is for the media blaster. So you have to trace which pipe goes to where. This is the green pipe. We recommend that you slacken the hose clamps and apply a little bit of lubricant, could be WD-40 or some similar product, which makes fitting them a lot easier. So they push on. And then tighten the clamps either with a slotted screwdriver or in this case an 8mm socket, which is a lot more friendlier. So that's the completed installation. Note that the pipes go this side of the foot, because otherwise when you lift it up, they would be in the way. And now we have a completed soda blaster, media blaster. And the next story will be Using it, we will show you how to fill it and use the, the soda blaster.